You could remember something about your days, in fact, like you know when you were. <laughs> it was like a deja vu. जो feelings मुझे आ रही थी जब मैं चल रही थी, I could feel the contestants feeling the same thing. But we have got great talent, and we should just wait and watch. Cat tips देंगे आप, cat tips दे रहे हो? नहीं, tips तो इनकी तरफ से आएंगे क्योंकि international जो cat walk है वो अलग होता है और बाकी contestants के हिसाब से. So I guess the right question should go to Bada. How lenient are you actually? At least एक finish कर देंगे हाँ. अच्छा हो सकता है. And judging like. Uh, How, how lenient you be or like, you know, what are the things then because you being a model yourself you can understand things much better the criteria diya jata hai wo criteria ke basis ke upar i am strict but at the same time uh, ek uh, vision hota hai ki ye contestant apne aap ko hold kar payegi ki nahi kar payegi so i am strict but a little bit of softness also is there yeah yeah then the what have you to say about how is it judging actually yeah. and how do they yeah. yeah. You feel to be in India every time like when you come. Ah, uh, well, this is my third time in India, and each time I'm very happy. But what I was especially noticing today is the difference between when the contest, the uh, Max Relief model, looks started uh, three years ago. I think that uh, it's still uh, changing this industry in India. And I was really, really pleased with the with the quality of the group today, which made the judging very hard. But um, I'm excited. excited Make things better. Results. Like, what are the things that every year you try to change, or the you know, like maybe the format? What are the things that you add actually every time? Um, it's it's hard to say exactly what to change. I think it's the 
it's more of the international element, the international thing that we're bringing into the contest here. What we are here with uh, for the Elite Model Look is to find young girls and young guys with the potential to have a modeling career on an international level. That means somebody that could be on the catwalk in Paris as they could be on the catwalk in, in New York. So sometimes the criteria are slightly different than the local criteria. But uh, I mean, that doesn't change the question of beauty, photogenics, etc. It's just uh, looking for potential for the international stage. Now, how did you find them actually? How did how are the how are they judging them? Actually? How does what sir? Judging them actually. You are judging the contestants actually. What is the experience judging them? Yeah. Um, as, as I just said, it's difficult. It was difficult to find only eight. In the meantime, we we all kind of had the same. More or less the same favourites, but in each group, the girls and the boys, there was a little bit of a deliberating at the end to find the group. If we could have had 10 girls and 10 boys, we could have easily found that. You can say you've been a legend also in this thing. What have you to say about the judging and the condition of that? I think this year our reach for Elite Model Look India has been phenomenal. We were able to permeate into around 10 cities and uh, I think we attracted in excess of 5,000 entries. So that in itself was a huge plus this year. I'm glad that we're getting younger boys and young, and young girls. As the boys and girls who win and they go abroad, they will find that uh, when they are competing internationally, they will find most of the boys and girls who are 16, 17, 18. And what are you really looking out for? Like, you know, in fact, like, see, you've been, you've been, you've been, and you've seen shows internationally as well as like you and in India itself. So, what are the things actually you look out for? You know, for well, with elite model yeah. look specifically, yeah. we look on youth. The emphasis is youth, the freshness, their own sense of style, their personality, the X factor. Somebody who is capable of having their own brand and who brings to the runway their own style and their own dominance. Uh, today it's all about you know being your own brand, uh, marketing yourself, and see whether you have that potential. It is our job to identify it, and uh, Elite internationally does the rest. Uh, Jennifer has been traveling all over the world, so she knows exactly what we're looking for. Uh, she has given us enough guidelines. Uh, when we go down to the national, uh, to the international final that is in Milan this year on the 29th of uh, November we actually get to see and learn a lot more and that when we come back to India we try and inculcate that in our selection procedure out here as well. So it's been good. Uh, collective intelligence is always good. That's why we have someone like Arjun Khanna who's been a stalwart 30 years in the industry. Alicia has been around for a long time. I've been around forever. Uh, you know. So it's good to have young boys and girls today who have this platform, who have the opportunity which we never had. You know, when we started, it was just us and us alone. Today, they've got a platform, they've got a credible platform, a safe platform, the only best platform for models in the world. Thanks. We saw you relaxing them also, in fact, in the condition, you could really you. feel you're making them a little comfortable also, like, you know. uh, so besides judging and all of them, what are the other things what you really try to, you know, help them out? And I'm, uh, for me, it's a, I look at it as overall. a job. I'm, 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 like Alicia said, she's a softy, I'm not. I uh, look for perfection. I'm never satisfied at the end of the day. Uh, so keeping that element aside, you know, I look at them and I realize that at the end of the day, these are young boys and girls, and it is a contest, and it's harsh. Uh, but that's we've got a job to do. So I am not harsh. I am extremely harsh when we come to judge. Uh, but other than that, you know, it's good to talk to them because there's a different side to that. You have to understand where they come from, their psyche, their the emotional connect, uh, each each one of them wants to succeed, to do well, and we got to take that into consideration and just motivate them, keep yes. them happy. Well, last thing, uh, what's your message to the young aspiring models who want to really make it in the uh, fashion world or maybe on the ramp? Uh, what are the small tip like? Well, maybe the, to the, the main tip that I give everybody when I meet is that finish your education. Uh, that is key, you know, because with a great education, you can never go wrong. Have a fling with modeling, you know, have a, it's a good hobby. If it works for you and it kicks off and you succeed in it, then pursue it. But up to then, have a good time with it, have a fling with it, but finish your education. That is key. With a good education, you can never go wrong. Okay. Thanks. Thanks.